hoping all are doing the best of their health, happy and having lots of fun. Today, we will tell you how to get rid of hiccups in a bit funny way. Hiccups are involuntary contractions of the diaphragm, the muscle that separates your chest from your abdomen, and plays an important role in breathing. Each contraction is followed by a sudden closure of your vocal cords, which produces the characteristic hic sound. Hiccups may result from a large meal, alcoholic or carbonated beverages or sudden excitement. In some cases, hiccups may be a sign of an underlying medical condition. For most people, a bout of hiccups usually lasts only a few minutes. Rarely, hiccups may persist for months. Typically, you can never expect hiccups to occur. There aren't scientific proven ways to stop hiccups because such studies are a bit hard to do. But there are few remedies that are found to be helpful in getting rid of hiccups. 1. Altering your breathing cycle, which may calm your diaphragm down. Possibilities include breathing into a paper bag, pulling your knees to your chest and leaning forward, drinking water from the opposite side of a glass while bending over, or holding your breath. If you do hold your breath, make sure that you don't do this indefinitely. 2. Gargling with ice water or sipping cold water. If you do gargle, make sure that you don't have so much ice in your mouth that you start spreading it around the room. 3. Pulling on your tongue. But don't pull so hard that your tongue comes out, which will lead to bigger problems. 4. Rubbing the back of your neck. Well, it's unclear whether adding the words there, there makes a difference. 5. Getting scared. A sudden scare may help, such as someone suddenly jumping in front of you in a Joker costume, or by wearing some scary mask. 6. Laughing spontaneously. They say laughter is the best medicine. Maybe someone else hiccups can get you laughing. Try these remedies. It will definitely help you to get rid of hiccups. Be happy, stay blessed and remember in your prayers, be God with you.